Let's take a tour of a three bedroom, one and a half bath home created using stud CAD software. I do have an original model that I built nine and a half years ago. It will be provided in the description below. It's pretty much the same house, about 99% accurate to the original. On the right hand side, we have ourselves a little garden fountain. In the center, we have an arch that takes you up to the front door. And on the left hand side, we have ourselves a single car garage. So let's do a little bit of a 360 view. A little side garden. Backyard that doesn't exist. I did use some of the older doors and windows in this model. That's what I used in the original. The side of the yard that doesn't have anything on it, except for just a small flower bed. Here's the top view. Not a whole lot to it. It's a very small house, mainly because it is two stories. Let's take a look at the interior. Now, just as a fair warning, there is no furnishings in this model. Haven't had a chance to really compile furnishings for it yet. So here we have our entryway with a nice tile foyer. Crude stairs that take you up to the second level. Here we have our living room or formal living room. Got a nice wood burning fireplace. Looks a bit too modern for this house. Rather plain and boring. Here we have the dining room where you can use it as a den. And in the back here we have ourselves a half bath. So let's zoom in on that one right there. And let's see. As you can tell there's no sink basin inside this bathroom so the water will just pour on the countertop. <laughs> That's how I built them back then. Here we have ourselves a nice little eating kitchen with a breakfast bar. Very crude kitchen. We don't have a refrigerator but we do have a stove, and an oven, and a sink. So at least I had my sinks built pretty cool back then. Let's take a look into the garage. Not a whole lot to it. This time it doesn't have junk piled in it like the last one. Oh, I don't remember. <laughs> Let's take a look at the second floor. Sorry I'm a bit little slow on this. I'm still getting used to the software. So here we have our second floor landing, and on the right hand side we have two smaller bedrooms, none of them which have doors. The original didn't have doors, but we do have a door on the full bathroom. So here we have our bathtub, our toilet, and our sink without a sink basin. So yes, there again I didn't even do that. I'm even critiquing my own work here. You know, this just shows you I've gained experience over the years building these things. On this side, we do have our master bedroom with the walk-in closet. Remember, in the original video, I had the walk-in closet full of utensils to kind of fill up that space. It was rather just dead space. I was trying to figure out what to put in there. and So, let's place on the roof. Now, the roof is just a solid roof. There's no attic access into this model. I never thought about putting anything in here. And I may someday revamp this project, make a version 2, and do some cleanup on it. So, pretty much, this was the first house I ever built and put on YouTube. And there's some things I want to change. Like I want to change this red door and these windows. They don't make those anymore. And these type of doors in the back, as long as with some of these other windows. All in all, though, this is one of my favorite houses. I think it deserves a second chance. This is like a chance and a half now using stud CAD software. 
But this just goes to show you that you can actually build exact models in the software. It looks really good. And it's a nice tour, no shaky camera this time.